the abandoned back stretch, as you can see, the band is about shoulder height. You can have red band, blue band, green band, whatever you think is going to create enough tension to create a nice stretch, but not pull it too much. Start off light, build resistance up. Now again, bands at shoulder height, we're going to place our hand through the band like so, on the back of our palms, and we're going to hold our fingers over it. We don't want to be squeezing it, because that's going to be working the bicep, and we're trying to take away tension. So wrap the hand through, fingers over like so, and we use that tension. And from here, we're going to take a few steps away, so the band is now under tension, pulling the shoulder across. You can either stand with your feet hip width, try and stand nice and square, creating that tension, that stretch for lats, rhomboids, bring it out, or you can go to a split stance like so. And we're going to hold this for maybe like 30 seconds, maybe a minute. Hold that, creating that tension, pushing the hips slightly across over to the uh, side that the band's pulling. And then once we've got that stretch and we're holding it, I want you to turn into it. So start rotating away from the band, creating a big stretch. And then back in. So again, we're going to start rotating away from the band and then back in. When you hold that rotation, so when you go into that rotation, hold it, get a slight stretch in, get a back stretch like so, and again back in, relaxed. Rotate in, get a big stretch, and in. Again, keep pushing the hips towards the band, get a nice straight back, your abs are holding, holding that stretch. And then relax. Change over, do the sexy on the opposite arm, work out which side has more tension, and then try and build that up so that you can get equal tension both sides. 